All right, yo, what's going, guys? John here. Welcome back to another video. And the uh, and yes, once again, like talking about the SmackDown hacker, of course, because um we didn't see him on Friday because I don't know, like because like he did he didn't need to expose anyone, but but uh yeah, so that's why like I'm gonna be talking about that SmackDown did not appeared. But the question is. Did the SmackDown hacker just literally saw what just happened? What just happened out there? What just happened out there? Like, you know, while well, there was an accident, you know, like Elias got hurt, and then, well, Je Jeff Hardy got arrested, of course. And then usually it turns out that Jeff Hardy just got released, of course, by the custody, of course, because he was getting tested by DUI, and then it turned out that he wasn't an alcoholic or anything. But, uh, yeah, so, uh, so yeah, so basically guys, like I just wanted to point out that uh so as you guys can see there's those blue circle lights and let me just like pull out the picture of the SmackDown hackers lights. Like as you can see though, um let's see the yeah, so here it is, like there's two blue lo blue circle logos on, on it of course, or the blue light I might say. And then there's like the blue light, like um like in the in the performance center so basically though that um that why he's like um that why he's like why they're using the lights you know to represent the, the the hacker of course because or maybe this possible like could it be like represent the the smackdown of course because smackdown is like blue of course so that's why like maybe like the lights like you know they shine as a they shine as blue, of course, because that represents SmackDown. But what if that blue light represents SmackDown, of course, instead of Mustafa Ali? And what if Mustafa Ali wasn't the hacker, of course? Well, it could be possible that Mustafa Ali is not the hacker, but yeah. But there's a lot of rumors saying that Mustafa Ali is a hacker, and I'm, and I'm pretty sure Mustafa Ali was the hacker, because he's been the police officer before in his real life, before he became... A full-time wrestler, of course. Wrestler, of course. So, basically, yeah. But, but like I said, it could be possible that Mustafa Ali can be the hacker, of course. But we also saw that yesterday, Shorty G just like literally returned, aka Chat Gable, of course. Like, which I don't know why, because, <laughs> because like, isn't he supposed to be like you know, working working with the hacker, of course, with the with Mustafa, of course, but maybe that Shorty G is not the hacker, but what if Mustafa Ali is the true identity of the hacker? Yes, this could be possible, though, because right now, I'm figuring out the pieces right now, because we saw the blue lights logos, the blue lights logo on the Performance Center, and we also saw the, the blue, the blue lights in the, in the, in the hacker's, uh, computer lab, whatever, but, yeah, but this could be possible that the true identity might be Mustafa Ali, of course, because I heard that the WWE probably confirmed that the true identity of the SmackDown hacker is Mustafa Ali, because, like I said, again, he was a police officer and in his in real life, of course, because he knows like those he knows like being a police officer, of course, and yeah, so maybe he was th thinking that. Or probably like the WWE was thinking that, all right, you know what? We're gonna put the, we're gonna put like the the mysterious hacker though. We're gonna put the the mysterious hacker as Mustafa Ali, so no one knows that he's literally the hacker. So guess what? I think the WWE did it, of course. But, you know, um, yeah. So I just like you know still can't wait until we see more like the WWE Smack SmackDown hacker, of course, because. Because you know, um, I'm just so interested of him, interested of him. Like, what he's gonna post, like on Twitter, of course. Because I'm gonna pop, I'm gonna pop up like the real WWE SmackDown hacker, of course. So, guys, if you wanted to like follow him, follow him on uh on Twitter. So let's just put like the message WWE, and you can see that um. That this is the WWE SmackDown hacker account, of course, 
of course, which isn't verified, of course, because, you know, he is the mysterious hacker, of course, so probably, like, you know, like, the Twitter don't know who, who he is, of course, because, you know, he is the truth, of course, and that's why he is called the WWE Smackdown Hacker, of course. But, yeah, so his username is The Message WWE, and, it, and yeah, so that's it, though. But the other ones, they are uh, literally fake. So, basically, yeah. So, don't follow the fake one, guys. But, yeah. So, uh, basically, though, like, what do you guys think? Do you think that he may expose, like, you know, expose, like, like, Jeff Hardy and Sheamus next? Because, I don't know. Because we saw that what happened out there, you know, that Elias got, got an accident, of course. Well, Jeff Hardy is getting arrested, but then turns out he got released by the DUI. And then he came back to the ring and then attacked Sheamus after Brian won to the semifinals. So, yeah, so basically, like, I just, like, I still can't wait for the for the hackers to, like, you know, to continue his story. To make the fans happy, of course, you know. But, when will the truth will be heard? Or should I say, when will he unmask him, um, unmask himself to see who he is? Oh, yes, guys. Like, maybe I think we are getting closer, of course, because, you know, maybe there might be a chance that he may unmask. Like, I don't know. Like, probably until, like, the fans come back or anything. Like, I don't know. But, but you know, maybe for now, like, the WWE SmackDown hacker just, like, literally just, like, posted posting new, like, just posting, like, you know, like, mysterious things, and then fans are, like, literally figuring out, like, so am I, because I'm actually a fan of WWE, of course, but, uh, <laughs> but, yeah, so, uh, so, yeah, so, anyways, guys, so, if you guys enjoyed the video, um, make sure to, uh, like, like the video, um, if you want to comment down below to see which videos you want to see next, just comment down below. Um, so, yeah, guys, so, I'll subscribe to me if you want to see more videos, and, uh, yeah, so, uh, oh, almost forgot, like, follow me on Instagram, on Twitter, Instagram, on Twitter, the link is gonna be in the description, and, uh, yeah, but anyways, guys, so, uh, I'll see you guys, uh, next time, so, uh, peace.